kom ons kyk nou na die indirekte rede, stellingsin en een vraagsin is wat met ons gaan werk. In een stellingsin gebruik ons die woord dat, wat de groep 3 voegwoord is. In een vraagsin gebruik ons die woord of, wat ook een groep 3 voegwoord is. En onthou, al jou voornaamwoorde verander. Using it in a statement sentence, we're using that as a group 3 conjunction where the verb goes to the end. And when we use it in a question sentence, we use of, which is also a group 3 conjunction and it pushes our verb to the end. In an example, we have hy sê, dit is goed, which is a statement sentence, so therefore we're using that, which is group 3 conjunction. It pushes the verb to the end and our answer is hy sê dat dit goed is. When we see a sentence saying, I fra, we know that fra is your question word, so therefore it's a question sentence. So we're going to use of as your joining word there. I fra, then we use of. Of kicks the verb to the end. I fra of dit goed is. And remember that our voornaam woorde has to change. Our pronouns changes, for instance, ek into hy. Let's look at an example. Ek sê, ek is nog. Ek is your pronoun, becomes ek sê dat, because it's a statement. Ek sê dat, ek moog is, the verb goes to the end. Or we can get hy sê, ek is nog, in the hy indicates us that the pronoun must change. Hy sê dat hy moog is. The act changes to hy.